Hello everybody, this is Final Flame Productions here, back with another Terminator Dark Fit uh, update news video, opinion video. Um, today I go back to the topic of John Connor. Another interview uh, has come out with, uh, this time it's Linda Hamilton, and uh, again, more bad news, no good news seems to be coming out from this franchise. It's uh, the spoilers ahead in case um, you don't want things spoiled. I just have to get it off my chest. This is possibly uh, possibly the worst news that could have possibly come out. Um, we kind of knew it already, but you had that little bit of hope that it mightn't be true. But it appears now that John Connor will be killed off in this uh, movie. Um, Linda Hamilton pretty much confirms it. Uh, the leaks suggested that John Connor would die in the first 10 minutes. So uh, Linda Hamilton said in a new interview that her uh, original mission has changed uh, she doesn't have a team anymore she's a thirst for vengeance she feels alone um, she's a wild card without a mission so this all pretty much uh, confirms that uh, John Connor isn't in the movie let's be honest he hasn't been in the trailers he hasn't been mentioned by any of the directors hasn't been mentioned by any of the cast um, you know he's the he's probably the second or third biggest character in the whole franchise and they've just ignored him um, simply because they know if they mention it, it okay maybe it'll spoil the plot of the movie but it'll piss off a lot of people uh, more than the people that know about it already um, I think this is a disgrace I think the Tim Miller is further proving he doesn't know what he's doing he could possibly be doing the worst damage to the franchise um, even worse than Genesis I think I mean killing John Connor is probably the worst idea um, I've said this before I think it's worse than killing Sarah Connor because while well, Sarah Connor is of course a well established and great character even it's even it's probably even worse than killing Arnie because at least Arnie can come back and there's a reason that you can bring him back and he's not always vital to every uh, plot thread. But John Connor's the entire point of the franchise is to, and even if, as I'm sure that the, the uh, J James Cameron and Tim Miller say, oh, well, the timeline's been changed. John Connor isn't the f the savior anymore. That's not an excuse not to have him in the movie. Um, his character could go forward. It, he could be like some drugged out drunk guy who has no mission anymore and feels he isn't important anymore but then maybe later becomes um, still wants to help and save the new savior there's a million ways you could keep that character alive but Tim Miller as he said in his interview isn't interested uh, in male characters and he's essentially getting rid of every male character that's in the franchise Arnold won't be in the next movie, so he's gotten rid of John. He's going to get rid of Arnold. He didn't even want Arnold in the movie already. So, um, as I said, I have no problem with the female cast. Love having Linda Hamilton back. The actors for the new, uh, the female actors for the other characters, I'm sure are fine. I haven't got much from the trailers, but I have no problem with them. I do have a problem with. Uh, Tim Miller's politics killing off one of the most important characters in the franchise just in such a terrible way I mean Terminal Salvation was going to do this I think several years back but the fan outcry shut it down unfortunately the idiots that are making this movie and James Cameron apparently is one of those idiots now um, I, I, I hate to be always negative about the movie which it seems I usually am maybe the trailer will look good but to kill off John Connor, to destroy his character, to me it ruins the movie even before it starts. Kind of like killing off Luke Skywalker, but at least that was at the end of the movie. You, you know, you could have en you enjoyed the stuff before it. Um, well, actually, in the case of Last Jedi, you probably didn't enjoy the stuff before it. Um, I don't know. It's it's not looking good, and if this movie doesn't do well, um, the franchise is gone. But they can't change it now. They're too far into it. Um, apparently, nobody with sense thought that killing John Connor was an idiotic idea that would piss off fans. And 
if you if you don't know about this story already, fans are pissed off that know about this leak, and Linda Hamilton's pretty much confirmed the leak. What do you think? Leave your comments in the comment section. Thank you.